Hi, Red Man. This is Peter calling you from Germany. I'm from New Jersey. I'm an independent artist. I live in Los Angeles. I wanted to know from your experience. So, Red Man, my question for you is... Everybody hears it all the time. Oh, you gotta have a live business. Well, easier yeah. said than done. But the yeah. truth of the matter is, is that as the whole record selling side of the equation has... Uh, I'll just say taking a hit or two, right? Right, right. Um, the live business becomes, you know, it's where lots of big artists are, are, are making their money, you know? If you're, yeah. you know, if you're Adele and you sold 20 million records somehow around the world, then right. you can make some money on publishing, you can make some money uh, selling records. Um, but that is almost freakish now when you compare it against the rest of, um, the playing field out there so the, you know to have a live business look old madge madonna you know she yeah. hasn't had a real hit in a while right but, but she's managed into her 50s to keep people's attention which is no small feat and right. so she makes a ton of money from touring right um, yeah and yeah. so 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 having an agent is a key part of it and that's why i was asking you how you got these gigs you know yeah um when you say they they found you how, how did they find you um, a couple of them actually saw me on YouTube and saw just some of the covers that I did, some of the Incubus covers, ironically, and, you know, some of the other things like that. And, um, you know, and I actually, um, I'm working with a company over in the UK right now that does um, TV and film, uh, you know, music for TV and film, and they also found me on YouTube. So, I mean, I think I've been very thankful for that, but as far as, you know, just getting like a tour down just to really promote, I just really want to get this heard. Well, <laughs> I think that's everybody. Here's something I would suggest, you know, in the short term, it's not the agent thing. Right. You, you, you've actually managed to get some attention, you know, on, on YouTube, right? So, so you know that at a certain level that can work for you, right? Yeah. I saw your, your videos and stuff, you know, obviously for full, full disclosure, I first became aware of you through a, you know, a kooky incubus conference, <laughs> yeah. right? And, uh, but one of the things that I look at, you know, with you, you're, you're, you've got a wonderful voice. Thank you. Um, you know, you, you're, you're, very, you're a beautiful young woman, and not that that's everything, but it doesn't hurt. Um, <laughs> you know what I mean? And, and when I see your videos, and I see some of the videos, you know, that I've already seen just on the Red Man Music and Business site, where they are, um, you know, where they just have a, a, a different point of view, right? Right, right. I sit there and I look at your page and I look at your videos and I'm thinking, you can definitely sense the singer and the performance, but what's missing is something that kind of paints a bigger picture of, yeah. of you, right? Right, right. And, and one of the things that I've been struck by is that it, it doesn't take a ton of money right now. It takes some creative people. It, it takes right. you finding some person or, or, or gal that wants to be, you know, a filmmaker that has a point of view about it, right? Right. And, and can paint a, a little bit, you know, different picture, or paint it in a more showbiz kind of way, right? So right, Does that right. make sense? Yes. And, and I know from my own experience here lately, I met these two guys that have helped me with my little Red Man music and business thing. They got, yeah. you know, they figured out, okay, I got an old guy who's not an opinion, but they, <laughs> they take these shots and make it look kind of important almost, right? Right, right. And that, there's something to that. And I think th that what is what I find missing. And the reason I say that is because if people found you on YouTube, they probably were watching the same videos that I was watching, right? right. Where they see a, a great voice, you know, a beautiful woman who's, who's got a real conviction about your delivery, Thanks. but th th there's, there's more to get there. So I would yeah. say you need to find some little creative muse, you know, somebody, you're living in New York City, ain't like there's any shortage oh, yeah. of people that want to be in the movie business. <laughs> right, right, exactly. And uh, you're a very charming person. You should use that, you know, and I say that, use it to, to yeah. get what you need on that front, you know. Back yeah. to the live thing, you know. Um, if you start playing around doing gigs in LA, in New York, in Nashville, in London, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, and, and, and I say this because there are lots of people out there that are in places that aren't close to those, and they and they might have some big decisions to make in in their lives in terms of pursuing their career. Right. Those are places that you can get noticed, but you got to show up regularly. You got to be able to promote 
your appearance, not just in, on the front end, but also at the back end. But so right. in that same notion about how to get Melissa Van Fleet painted in a way that competes with the other people okay. that you're aspiring to be, mm -hmm. even on the live side, that same filmmaker guy that gets two cameras, that gets some movement, that gets, instead of just being in the clanking bar, Right. from a distance that gets around and makes right. people feel part of it. That's what, you know, bands spend all kinds of money now because everybody's watching video screens at their show. I find myself at freaking Incubus shows watching the fucking video, right? <laughs> yeah. You know, right there. But it's because we you, you've got tricks now that make people, make the person in the last row feel like right. they're in it. And so, yeah. Uh, you know, the technology out there is there, and I've been yeah. freaking unbelievably impressed with what people are doing for no money, and you need to do that as well. Sounds okay. good to me. I definitely will do it. Thanks yeah. so much. Um, but as far as getting an agent, I think if you're playing around in town, okay, uh, you have a chance to attract some agencies there, you know, in the business. The, the thing I say to people all the time is if they're... Every artist has some frame of reference, somebody that they go, that one inspired me. Or, you know, if they were being honest, they go, I'd like to be like, you know, Lady Gaga, or I'd like right. to be like, you know, Adele, or I'd like, to, you know, they put fence posts up. And I think if you, if you, if you try to sit there and think about your career and paint a picture in your head of where you want to be, right? Yeah. Then for me, it's always about going and sniffing around backwards, kind of playing the course backwards. Okay, if that's where I want to be, how did they get there? Who are right. the people that are in there, right? Mm -hmm. that, have, that have been a part of that process, right? And you find out who the players are. And it's, and it, it's not easy, but it's much easier with the internet. For Christ's sake, you can find anybody on the internet now, right? Yeah. Um, and, you know, you, you got to make that connection there, you know? And mm -hmm. so those are the things that people need to do and I know it's tough and even today in the chat room people go it's tough I want to put a, <laughs> I want to put a sign up on my fucking door that says fuck me I know it's tough I've been doing this 30 yeah. years I get it okay yeah absolutely but you need to decide if it's too tough then get out okay right. it, you know but let's not spend a lot of time on it's tough okay right. oh yeah um, but going out and playing giving people some repetitive chances to see you getting a better look from those gigs and a better look when you're just standing in front of a piano playing, right. uh, I think would make a big difference in terms of you presenting yourself in a, in a, in a kind of world-class way because you have a great voice, you've got all the, the requisite stuff going on there. Right. Um, but it's all about presentation. presentation. It's all about timing and lighting and, 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 yeah. and, and remembering that this is freaking showbiz for Christ's right. sake. You know what I mean? Exactly. And so uh, so that's, that's my one thought there, you know? Um, that's great. What else can I help you with here, Melissa?